friends welcome to without a clue painting again as promised I told you I would let you know how you can paint in a two and a half by three foot area this is an overview if you take a look down to your lower right you'll see that 100 number behind that cardboard box that is the air compressor unit going on up to the regulator going into the spray booth we just did see the last tutorial video that we did <clears throat> behind it is my reference library and then you can see the tops of tacky glue that is uh, basing world my tools of the trade <clears throat> always have one of those little bit collectors and then the tower and altar to paint so you have to go vertical and up if you were to pull away the chair what you'll see is you'll see my gaming box That is a uh, battle foam big mama that can carry everything. My next projects, the air compressor. That box is full of paint stands. I use blue tack and old model bottles. And it also has some old foam bits in there for uh, being able to do weathering effects. And then, of course, you got to have a Dremel. Um, on the table itself, we'll wait for the camera to focus the actual brushing station flames of war uh, airborne recon platoon a little bit close up on altar of paint and the spray booth we just built right next door one of the things that you gotta remember with a spray booth or an airbrush it's sort of like a Quasinart sewing machine anything else if it's in the cupboards it ain't gonna get used so if you have the ability to mount it to a station where it's easy it'll be incorporated don't make airbrushing into an ordeal this is just a little bit about how to get sorted you'll see some space marines that are my sons that i'm working on and so those are the projects one of the important things in these small spaces use a bottle of paint put it back use a tool put it back you don't have room to mess around with you might be wondering why in the wild world of sports is a dewalt drill doing in the middle of the hobby station well that's my patented Vallejo paint mixer, and we'll do a tutorial on that after we get done with this. So now back to the color commentary. <clears throat> 